everyone! Welcome back to my channel. My name is Moira and today I am going to be answering all of your comments before 2019 ends! <laughs> By the way, I got a haircut. Ooh! I'm just straight on hair ko today and hindi ko lang paano siya ayusin. But anyways, I am going to be answering your comments because I did a talk this month tapos sabi ko, you should reply to all your comments. Pero honestly, minsan hindi ako nakaka-reply. Either dahil paulit-ulit na kasi siyang tinatanong and nasagot ko na siya before. Or hindi enough para sa akin nasagotin ko lang siya through text. Mas gusto ko na ganito na I could expound on it. Kasi yung ibang questions sobrang deep eh. Um, okay, so yun. So today I'm going to be answering the comments aka yung comments that have questions on them. I don't know if I could be able to answer all of them but hopefully I will. So anyways, enough of this intro and let's get right into the video. Woo! Okay, so I have my cell phone right here and I'm gonna go to the YouTube Studio app. Dito sa YouTube Studio, you can see all of the comments, all of the newest comments, kahit na it's from a very, very old video. Let's start. Alright, first question pa lang, guys. What is your next step na, Ate Moira? Uh, my next step is I'm gonna get a job. Yes, 2020. Ito na <laughs> I'm gonna get a job. I'm gonna claim it. Um, I did actually go to some interviews last year year but I just didn't feel like yun na yun. So I'm gonna explore more options or whatever and hopefully um, I'm gonna love my job. <laughs> <laughs> okay. From my latest video where I use my DJI Osmo Pocket. Um, magkano siya sis? Yung DJI Osmo Pocket. I bought mine from the DJI store in Trinoma and we bought it for 20, around 21k. Merry Christmas, Ate Moira. Merry Christmas. Um, saan po kayo nakakabili ng Friends merch? Um, from the one that I showed, Geller shirt was from the Perfect White shirt. And then yung Friends shirt na may scene no Halloween is from cotton on. May tuition po ba sa UP? As far as I know, wala. Hopefully, it will stay that way. From my final submissions video, saan niyo po ginawa yung mga diagrams niyo po? I made them in SketchUp. Hello po, ano po yung parang color yellow na gamit niyong pandikit? It's called Uhu Blue. At least that's how I pronounce it. You could buy it at usually art supply stores. I never saw it in national. So, ayan. Nag-comment siya. So, Jolly's po ba? I will say yes. Woo! Ito. This is a question that I have been asked so many times. Kailangan ba magaling sa math pag mag-aarki? Tanong ko lang po. Or mahirap pa ang math? Ano ba yung math na pinag-aaralan sa arki? <laughs> math in architecture, at least in UP, we had three math subjects. The first one is called Math 11, aka College Algebra. The second one is Math 14, aka Trigonometry. And Math 54, I think, that was Calculus. Mahirap ba ang math? Um, depende sa inyo if you like math or if you don't. Ako kasi personally, math is my favorite subject. As nerdy as it sounds, it's true. I love math. For me, college algebra, that was my favorite. I like algebra. Oh, ayan na. I like algebra. So, brown nerd ko. Trigonometry naman. Trigonometry is okay, pero medyo doon na ako nag-start na. Oh my god, ang daming equations. Yung may sin, cos, cos, sin, ganun, mahaba. The last one, calculus, yun talaga yung sobrang, wow, <laughs> ano to? <laughs> Eventually, sana yan lang talaga siya. So, yun. Yun yung mga math talaga. Kailangan Ang magaling ka sa math? Um, honestly, I don't think so. Yung mga pinag-aralan namin, parang hindi ko din naman siya sobrang nagagamit sa kapag nagde-design ako. So, why you are mixing English with Filipino? I can't understand what you're saying. It's because <laughs> my audience is mainly Filipino. So, I'm sorry if I'm not speaking English all the time, but I just think it's easier for me. And since yun nga, puro Filipino lang naman nanonood halos. And sobrang liit lang ng percentage ng foreign. Hi Moira, I'm an Archifreshi. Your vids help a lot. Thank you. Anything you learn from presenting your designs to different profs throughout the five-year course? Any tips or strategies? Figure one, always show up. As in, every chance you have to consult with your professor, go for it. Tata ko dati sa amin, every week, may one day to consult. And ako, lagi yung pumupunta sa day na yun, kahit na konti lang yung progress score or something. Masyad lang ako goody two-shoes na hindi ko alam na pwede pala mag-skip. As in, yung iba ko palang kaka. As in, nag-skip sila. Samanta lang ako lagi yung pumupunta kasi akala ko kailangan pero hindi naman pala. Okay, pero it really helped me kasi mas nakikilala ako nung professor ko. Alam talaga nila kung paano ka as a student. And then second is to always bring a notebook with you. Um, write down everything that the professor says, lahat ng comments and suggestions niya. And then change the design only if 
it's because of code, as in kasi kailangan pasok sa code and hindi pasok yung ginawa niya. If you really like what the professor is suggesting, yun, gawin nyo. But at the end of the day, ikaw pa rin yung designer. So kung ayaw nyo gawin yung suggestion ng prof nyo, edi wag. <laughs> Ate, anong gamit mong laptop? I mean, anong model or specs? I am using a Lenovo IdeaPad. It's the fifth inch one and honestly I have no idea what the specs are kasi nung binili namin to yung dad ko yung kumausap sa, dun sa nagbebenta kasi wala akong masyadong alam when it comes to those stuff. So then another question that I get to ask a lot is okay lang ba mag ako kahit Hums, mo, hindi ko alam pa ni pronounce. <laughs> Student ako sa senior high or kailangan ba STEM or ganito, ganyan. Honestly, the answer for me is I don't know. <laughs> Ayan na, lumalabas na edit ko. Hindi ko naabutan ang K-12. So, I have no idea what the strands are all about. Best if you just ask your teacher from junior or senior high. Kasi ako personally, hindi ko yan pinagdaanan. How much po sa Data Blitz yung Sims? I bought mine back in 2014. I think it was around 2000 plus. I don't know how much it is now, but if you want to buy, I suggest you just buy online, download Origin, and dun na lang kayo bumili para you don't need a physical copy anymore. That's where I buy my expansion packs, stuff packs, online na lang. Ate, bakit po sabi ng classmate ko, 4 years na lang daw po, RQ sa UST? Um, that I'm not sure. Um, I know 5 years pa rin sila. Ang alam ko lang na mas maikse is sa CSB because trimester sila. Ate, pwede po ba kayo gumawa ng design sa bahay sa Roblox? I did a sim series kasi and some people suggested that I do Roblox or Minecraft next. Pero honestly, I have no idea what those video games are all about. I'm not even sure if it's on PC or PS4 or whatever. I may not be doing that <laughs> kasi nga, iiyak na yung laptop ko kung sa PC siya. Ate, how do you write your college papers? Usually, I try to avoid them as much as possible. <laughs> Depende kung 100 words lang. Carry yan, gawin mo na agad-agad. Pero kapag yung talagang mahabang papers, um, usually, I yun nga, I try to put it off. But while I'm putting it off, medyo iniisip ko na siya in my head. Like, pag nakatulala lang ako sa class, minsan parang, ano kaya ang pwede kong isulat sa paper na yun? Ewan ko, sobrang weird ko. Ganun ako, habang naglalakad lang ako, iniisip ko, ano kaya pwede ko ilagay? When it's time for me to actually write the paper, um, yun, type ko lahat ng mga naisip ko. And then, I try to make an outline, but not really. Basta ko ano yung mga gusto ko ilagay, yun, parang phrases muna. And then, if may naisip akong magandang quote or sentence na feel ko, ooh, lagay natin to. Yun, lalagay ko din siya. And that's how I form a college paper. Eto. Congrats po sa'yo. Thank you. So, UP Diliman po yung may nagwe-welga, no? Nakapag-welga ka na po ba? May nagsabi kasi sa akin na di ka, di ka daw makaka-graduate nang hindi ka nagwe-welga. Di ko lang kung totoo. Totoo po ba? No, I've never went to any rallies. The only thing that I went to, I think, is a... Hindi ko lang walkout ba tawag doon? Ganun. Yung sa AS Tips. Not that I'm against it. I actually think it's um it's just a way to for people to speak up when they're not being heard. So, yun. In my whole UP life, I've never went to any rally but there was one rally that I wish that I was there kaso nakauwi na kasi ako <laughs> kasi biglaan lang yung rally na yun pero pinanood ko na lang siya sa TV Hi, ito. I'm not good at drawing. Makakapekto kaya yun sa pagtiko ng architecture. Another question that I get asked often. I've said this before that drawing is not the same as designing. Um, you don't have to be a good artist to become a good architect. Basta kaya mong i-translate yung imagination mo. Kasi ngayon, mas marami nang ginagamit na computer programs ang architecture. So, I don't think it's too much of a big deal if you know or don't know how to draw. What do you use for editing your vids? I use Sony Vegas Pro. Public po ba yung UP Diliman? Yes. Hi po ate, paano po kayo natuto mag sketch up? Self-study po ba yan? Or may subject po kayo na prof ang magtuturo? Meron kaming subject na nagturo yung prof. But it was so basic as in like one sem lang. And then most of the other stuff, you really have to self-study. Like watch YouTube tutorials or paturo kayo sa kaklase nyo kasi maraming sketch up extensions na hindi tinuturo sa school. Minsan po ba naisip isip nyo na lang na magtrabaho sa ibang bansa? Uh, of course, I have. And honestly, gusto ko din siyang matry. Just for the sake to know what it's like to live in a different country and be immersed in a different culture. But right now, I don't see myself moving in another country for good. Parang iba pa rin kapag nasa Pilipinas ka and like kasama mo yung uh, buong family mo, extended family. And when it comes to being 
an architect in the future. I ko, feel ko parang I was privileged enough to study architecture, tropical architecture pa nga, So why should I not give back to my country? That makes sense. Ang cheesy ba no? Ito, may requirement po bang grades pag mag-shift ng RT course? Honestly, I don't know too. I think natanong din sa akin to dati. Like, shifting or transferring ano daw requirement. Hindi ko siya alam kasi hindi ko rin siya naranasan. So, best if you just check, I don't know, the registrar's website. Next, I'm gonna answer a lot of questions from my room makeover video that I did. Hindi ko pala nalagay kung saan ko binili yung mga stuff. Kung bakit? Um, so, anyway, my table is from Classic Modern Interior. My mirror, ayan yung nasa harap ko right now, is from Vanity Mirror Manila. Then the chair that I used to have, the ghost chair, is from the Fur Factory. And then, ano pa binili ko dito? And then yung wardrobe ko is from Urban Concepts. My shelves are from Wilcon. Oh, diba? Tinignan ko lahat ng... <laughs> Dito sa kwarto, saan ko ba binili? And last, <laughs> comment how much daw yung nagastos ko for my whole room makeover. Um, and when I computed it, it was around... 40,000 pesos. Kaya siya malaki kasi I bought a new wardrobe and that wardrobe cost like mga 20k. Good. But guys, that is it for this video. I hope I've answered most of your questions. And if you have more questions to ask me, you could just leave them in the comment section down below. And maybe I'll make another Q&A video sometime. You could also message me through Instagram. Um, nag-reply naman ako doon. At that's Moira. Hey, follow me. Also, follow my second Instagram account, moira.ootd. Um, yun. So, anyways. Oh my god, that's it. This is the last video for 2019. The last video for the deck. <laughs> this is me at the start of the decade and me at the end of the decade. Hey. <laughs> I guess before I end this video, I just want to say thank you, thank you very much to everyone who has subscribed to my channel and even those who aren't subscribed who still watch my videos. <laughs> what up? <laughs> uh, I remember the time when I started this YouTube channel and hindi ko pa share masyado sa mundo. So we need to think that there are actual people who subscribe to my channel, who watch my videos na hindi ko sila pinipilit. <laughs> Today, I am ending with around 7,000 subscribers and I know that for some people, it's not a big number but for me, it is. And I'm very, very grateful for each and every one of you. So thank you very much for subscribing, for watching my videos, for all your likes and comments. Hopefully, next Next year, we could get to 10,000 subscribers. Eh, kapag nangyari yun, magpapag-giveaway ako. Ayan, sinabi ko na. <laughs> okay, but anyways, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit subscribe and also don't forget to click on the notification bell so that you're updated whenever I post a new video. Comment down below what video you want to see next and I will see you all next year. Bye!